All right, peep taste test. Peep taste test. Should I Wait, that we're going to blindfold myself? Right. This is crazy. We're going to do a blind peep tasting. No, I don't know. Can you look up stuffed rabbits? No, let's just, just trigger me. <laughs> why are you doing this to yourself? I'm afraid of stuffed rabbits because I, I want you guys to understand or see it. So why is it that Clown College is harder to get into than Harvard? Is that true? That's they what have used a, to say. They have a lower acceptance rate. So they are, they are denying people at a rate <laughs> that is higher than Harvard. All right, let's do it. Bring us in, Daddy-O. Welcome back to the Picky Boys Podcast. Welcome. Jesus Christ has risen. Starting off hot. Oh, it's It's April. Easter. It's, oh, it's... It's March 31st. Oh, it's not even April. Isn't that weird? A weird March Easter. A, Very rare. It's been a weird March. I don't have... That's it. That's all I got. Sure. I feel like. Yeah. When was St. Patrick's Day? It's March 17th. Every also year. a Sunday. Wait, so when oh, is... When it's is, weird was, March. Yes. When is Easter? Like, what's the rule? <laughs> the third... I thought it was the third uh, Sunday of April. That's what no, I thought. No, 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 no. It's something about the moon and the... No. Yes, it's a, lunar, it's a lunar thing. And then that determines when Ash Wednesday is. And then 40 days from Ash Wednesday is when Easter is. And they happen... Because I didn't know that holidays, they could just... Like, I didn't know they are allowed to switch months. Right. Like, who gave... Easter permission to be in March. I knew that they could, oh, oh, it's the third Friday. Sometimes it's the 17th. Sometimes it's the 20th. I didn't know they could switch months. It's one of the only ones that does, I think. So does that mean the groundhog has effect on when April is? That's when Ash Wednesday starts, yeah. I don't... Because it's... Easter, the first Sunday after the full moon that occurs on or after the spring <clears throat> equinox. That's too many words. Yeah, what the... That's how <laughs> science so some guy you have sits to get. there, he calculates this every year? You know what else know. has risen? Sales of Peeps. Peeps is like one of those candies that once a year they have their thing, they boom, and then they just hide. Probably one of the worst candies. Yeah, th- thank God. Keep them hidden. Really? Fuck, yeah, I love Peeps a Peep. Are, Peeps are so a terrible. marshmallow Peep? No, no they're terrible. Aw- they're awful. But are they awful? I'll tell you what, <laughs> though. Terrible. Even though they, are all, they all taste the same, the shapes make a difference. They don't all taste the same. Yeah, they do. No, they don't. They mm-hmm. pretty much I've do. I've had coffee peeps. Oh, my God. No, now I'm not talking about like, oh, raspberry peep. Obviously, those taste different. <laughs> oh, also. you're just talking about the regular peep. Yeah, Marshmallow sure. the ducks peeps. versus like the, the fucking, I don't Snowman know, or yeah. whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah, obviously not flavored peeps. Are they ducks? Chickens? Chicks. 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 Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Chicks. Um, yeah, let's just open the package, I think. Okay. We got a package sent to our P.O. box by Ariana. That's her name, I believe, right? Yes. yes. So, right. We, uh, if you want to send us packages, you could, Jason, have more work. Pop it up right here. Right here is the P.O. box. Just giving more work to Jason. Uh, that's our it's our address. It's Easter themed, so that's why we're opening it here. Yes. We typically open them on Patreon, patreon.com slash picky boys. Um, but this one's Easter themed, so we might as well open yeah, it. So, it's Easter Sunday. So, audio listeners, get in here. Let's watch this one because I think it's going to be very visually stimulating. I got a sneak peek at it, and, and ooh, this is. Uh, oh, damn. Oh, a lot of, lot of effort. Went speaking into this. of extra work for Jason, we also have a top cam. Wow. We got a little notes. The note basically says, thanks for, uh, congrats for passing 600. Um, this package is basically an Easter egg hunt in a box. So some will have names on them and some um, will not, and that's just for everybody. And yeah. So we're just going to do a little hunt? Yeah. Oh my God. Let's it's do a little hunt. Kit Kat Churro. Give me that. You immediately found it. Yeah, give me that Kit Kat Churro. Because I know Jason wants it. He's not allowed to have it. And Tony's going to cut right. the sides so that we can kind of have this uh, open face on the table. Oh. Oh, speaking of the peeps. Kind of like an old crate. It's very possible that we're messing up this whole thing, but I'm sure there's stuff in there. I'm not good with my left hand, JT. I don't know if I'm cutting yeah. through things also. Yeah, I mean, you got it pretty much. I've, I've always wanted to receive a I package also have to that's in a crate. I have to open with like a crowbar, you know. There's a lot of stuff. Try not to dig too deep. There we go. Oh, so nice! I don't it's working. Cut any well. of the insides. It's working well. Sheesh. Got another one. Jason. Yeah. yeah. Can we get that away? From the, keep that away from Jason pile. All right. JT, I was good to you. <laughs> wow. That was a little hard. My bad. Oh wow! There's all hard. kinds of Kit Kat churros in here. All Ooh. kinds wow. of Kit Kat churros. Right. So a little treasure hunt. So it's a little treasure hunt. Oh, there's all kind of Kit Kat churros. I got a Hershey's Kiss. Keep them all. Oh, I got a two. Oh, we got some more novelty glasses. What? These are some St. Patrick's Day ones. So there's eggs. So well, if if I find one with a name on it, do I just get to take his present or? This one says I'm Ant. Not sure. So I'm keeping that one. Love Kit Kats. Oh, oh this sheesh. one says Ant too. We all got some St. Patrick's. I'll Day be glasses. honest. I'm seeing e- ears in here, and I don't like that. 
Oh yeah, you're afraid oh, of stuffed. Oh, rabbits. you don't like it? I don't like that. You don't oh. like it, Antonio? Oh, but it's a hat. Oh, this is. Oh wait, oh, actually, this is, this is fire. fire. What the hell? I thought it was a bunny. I thought it was a bunny too. I got a little scared. Oh, they look so comfy. What? <laughs> dude, it's a fuzzy oh, hat. Oh yeah, dude. This is awesome. Oh my god. We probably do, should be describing everything we find in case there are still audio listeners. That's but true. So we have we uh, got a what is this, a baseball uh, cap with bunny ears on it? A it's all furry. Fuzzy? It's a furry baseball cap with bunny ears. Very comfortable. By very the way. soft. It's very comfortable. I love an Easter egg hunt. I found a JT one. Oh shit. Oh kisses. This is very thoughtful. This is wild. Yes, I love the presentation and just everything. All oh, right, look at this. so presentation is the best part. You were just talking about peeps, actually. So how about you eat all of these, <laughs> and then you tell me that. Oh, so this is fruit punch Whoa, flavored peeps. Try that uh, one. No, you gotta try that one. Uh, this one's party cake. That one's cotton candy. Doctor Dr. Pepper? Pepper peeps. We gotta try these, right? Probably. Yeah, we all see. This is why you shouldn't be fucking shitting on things before you know whether you are you might eat them. I guarantee know? I'm not gonna like them. Guarantee I'm not gonna I like bet those. this Dr. Pepper peep is better than you think. Jelly Let's beans. Ew. Do you like jelly beans? I like her jelly beans. Jelly beans suck ass. Blue raspberry peeps. What do you mean? I didn't jelly know there bean? were this many peeps. Oh my god, there's even more. Strawberry peeps. Rice crispy treats those are, peeps. Those sound good. Those are probably really good. Should we just do a, a sour can watermelon? I get, that, can I get that knife? It's just gonna turn into a peep tasting. Can it be video? a blind? Peep tasting video? I feel like you'll know what this is. I don't know. If you if you give me one of each one, I can try to... You're not going to be able to tell the difference between a strawberry peep and a Dr. Pepper peep. But maybe That's a strawberry dark. peep and a fruit punch peep. Where's the, the where's cake the, peep right. and the cotton candy all peep. All right, where's the knife? Where's the knife? Let's get all the peeps. This one's sparkly wildberry. This is s'mores peep. All right, we got it. We got Wow, okay. Well, this turned into a whole video this now. This is a peep video. And I think we have... There's so many peeps in here. What the hell is that? This is a peeps pop. No, it's a Mike, Mike and Ike. Ike. Oh, I Peeps love pop. Mike. You Ike. like Mike and Ike? Really? Oh, JT, I found something also, for you, brother. Uh, I believe she said all all Peeps are gluten free. By the way, really? How do you know that? Uh, she said it in the thing. Oh, actually, oh, this this one isn't. <laughs> <laughs> Just so immediately wrong. Oh, I know Danny loves this. Uh, uh, most of them are though, except for this Mike and Ike's one. I know Danny good. loves these, and I found them, oh, so they're mine now. No, no, no. I found them. It was my hunt. Finders, finders, keepers. Doobie keepers. Finders do be keeping them. Oh my. God, it's all right. All right. Well, now you're just cheating. You're just, oh my God, there's more. Don't let, don't let, don't let. Wow. Me. This one has Danny name on it. Oh. You you really just took out the whole. Let's uh, search through this and just lifted up the grass. <laughs> Minecraft, fifteen tattoos and fifteen stickers. <gasps> Reese's Reese's carrot. This is an adorable oh, wow. carrot. This is, this is hilarious. It's a Reese's pieces carrot. I'm gonna be. That's amazing. The Kit Kat churro goblin, and all you need to come for come to me with this. And now Jason has one because JT's a bad person. Also, I think that one is for Chaz, that little goodie bag. Oh, it's, Chaz Chaz missed out on the Chaz last one. Chaz was here last time for the Valentine's Day opening. Name? There was oh, nothing my name. for him. This is for Chaz, but it happens now he's not here for this one. And this one has your name, Danny? Yeah. Lovely grass. Way less of a mess than last time. Yes. This is easy to clean up. Last time uh, it was... Oh, and there's so many little hidden ones. Heart confetti. This is for Jason. Wow. Thank you. All right. So now we're tasting peeps. All right. Peep taste test. Peep taste test. Should I Wait, we're gonna... blindfold myself? Right. This is crazy. We're going to do a blind peep tasting. All right. So you got to tell me. So you're not going to get a you know, a word bank. You just got to guess the flavors here. Hold the box next to this. I already kind of know some of them, though. You do already kind of know some of them. So we'll, we'll tell them what it is after. No, show the camera, yeah. I guess it's easier to show this camera, probably. All right. All right. Here you go. Good luck. I love peeps, so I'm very excited. Do they no, have a smell? You can't smell them. Uh, it's a good question. Do they? Not really. Really? They don't smell like anything? What does that taste like, baby? Do you like it? First question. Do you like it? Yes. Okay. You got this. Now, what does it taste like? Um, that one tastes just kind of normal, like marshmallowy. Um, we need an answer, baby. Is it? Is it the cake one? Birthday cake? No. No. What was it? Cotton candy. Oh, cotton candy. Come on, bro. Okay, okay. I, have more, I have more faith in you than I'm that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Cotton candy. It just kind of tasted like a regular peep, honestly. Wow, this one tastes like you'd expect. What do you think? Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. I think this is the fruit punch one. Wrong. Once again, this is the Dr. Pepper peep. Wow. Does it taste good? Yeah, all of them are delicious. You don't really have a palate cleanser. 
No. It's a lot of sugar in your mouth, honestly. They are blending together. They're all subtle flavors. Mm-hmm. Mm, but that's really good. Really? Oh, yeah. Now that you say it, I can taste the 23 spices. 23 herbs and spices? Yes. <laughs> I think that's KFC. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, the herbs and spices definitely are. But All right. Next one. KFC's only 11. Dr. Pepper's 23. They use more spices. Who uses more spices? Dr. Dr. Pepper? Pee, baby. Really? It's got a PhD. Mm. Oh. All right, what do you think? This one is the s'mores one. Jesus, this guy's terrible. This is this the Rice Krispie Peep. Oh. <laughs> this guy, he's just eating peeps. He's not, he's not, <laughs> Take some bad time. day. Dude, he's not even playing the game. He's just <laughs> eating peeps and just randomly guessing. It's a very subtle flavor. You, would, you wouldn't be good at this. Uh, no, I wouldn't be good at all. I didn't also didn't claim that I would be really good. Like someone to my... Right, I, I just said we should do it. I didn't say, oh, I know every peep with my eyes closed. All right, th- you kind of did say that exactly. This one feels like cheating, but here, you could have this one. Oh. Well, that was a hard crunch. Mm. Oh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Jason. Does it taste sexual? Yeah, what does it taste like? This one is the s'mores one. <laughs> Jesus Christ, <laughs> Danny. You're joking, it's, right? it's a sh- strawberry. Oh. It's chocolate-covered strawberry. <laughs> He's just Danny. eating peeps. He's just Danny. eating peeps. What? How is, okay, just, I get the flavor is subtle, but s'mores versus just, strawberry. What the hell is going on here? Peeps. All right, now I taste the strawberry. Oh. <laughs> he's just eating peeps. Oh, bro. that one's really good. <laughs> that one, that this, that little sh- shell of chocolate. He says that for every one of them. No, no, this one's really good though. All right, that shell of chocolate is really something. Yes, it is. Speaking. Oh, of it's shell. another shell of chocolate. <laughs> it's true. He has a couple. Oh wow, he's going for it. Okay. Which one do you think you have? This one's tricky. Why? Come on, you got it. Pull up the camera. Yep. Is that the s'mores one? <laughs> <laughs> Danny, it's the same it's one. The same one. No. <laughs> it's the same oh. One. It's the same one, dude. God damn it. <laughs> okay, okay. Here we go. Next one. I trusted you that there was multiple. <laughs> I mean, wouldn't you taste it? <laughs> it was back to back. <laughs> Next one. No, go fuck yourself. <laughs> go fuck yourself. No, no, this no. is... <laughs> what do you think that one is, Danny? <laughs> this is the s'mores. <laughs> right? <laughs> Same one. No, no. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. That one's a s'more. That yes. One, that one's a s'more. Is that one good? Mm-hmm. Next beep. There we go. Dude, this is so hard. That's a soft peep. My fingers are full of peep dust, by the way. I don't know. Maybe is this one like a blueberry? Blueberry? It's a birthday cake. Oh. You are not I very think, good. I need a... I need an amuse bouche. Don't use those words. <laughs> what is that? Don't use yeah, those words. Like a palate French out here? I need an amuse bouche. Don't use the words with me here. Next peep. How many more are there? Bro, there's, there's quite a few left. You got it. This is the fruit punch one. Yes, it is. Does it taste like fruit yes. punch? Yes. Does it taste like fruit punch? Subtly. Subtly. All right, here we go. Not many left now. Mm-hmm. Here you go. Oh, fuck you. What is this? There's a few, man. Which one is this? This is the chocolate covered strawberry. <laughs> okay, now he's got it. <laughs> the now he's got it. He's tasted three times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three times the charm. All right, here. What about this one? Danny's eating so many peeps. <laughs> <laughs> it's so many peeps. He's all peeped up out he's here. He's all peeped up, dude. My mouth can barely taste anymore. <laughs> it's just coated in peep dust. So many peeps. Is this a blueberry? That one is blue. peep flavored. <laughs> blue raspberry. Blue so raspberry. I guess it, I guess so. That counts. Here. Oh, oh! <laughs> is this a human centipede? <laughs> <laughs> that was good. A <laughs> human centipede. Which one do I eat? <laughs> that one, I guess. Mm. Right. Mm. Right. Ew. No. This is the Mike and Ike's one. It is. It is. Yeah. It is. Yeah. Which flavor is that? I like. I love Mike and Ike's. Cherry. Strawberry. Mm. All right, last one. You're out of the woods. That's it. All right, the final peep. The final peep. (laughs) (laughs) What about that one? 
s'more. <laughs> It's the strawberry. How many do you have? How many <laughs> strawberry ones? Strawberry. You, I feel like I thought I counted four. I thought I ate all of them. <laughs> strawberry. God beans. damn it! <laughs> this one eludes me. <laughs> that one has that's Danny's uh, kryptonite. Well, there you that go. Was fun. Yeah. I bet you you didn't expect to eat thirty peeps today. All right, you want to clean this up and uh, get back to potting? Uh, we're gonna clean. How are we gonna clean? I'm trying to. Oh, the box. Yeah, the box is gone, bro. We'll get a bag. We'll get a bag. 2,000 years later. Oh. What? The serving size is that you're supposed to eat all four of them. Really? <laughs> yeah. 200 calories. Oh, that's not that bad. Per four serving peeps. Per four and chocolate on chick those. serving. I think. Yeah. And there's chocolate on 200. Wait, what? <laughs> they were really good. I mean, this, they're very light and airy. This is 270. That's true. This is 270. Yeah, wow. Look at that. I didn't know Peeps had so many uh, flavors across all these brands. I, mean, I think every Rice treat. every brand now has a thousand flavors. You know, if you're a brand and you want to compete, you gotta be collabing. You know, yeah, you gotta be collabing, oh, especially so, a band like Peeps who can just fade into obscurity. I don't think Peeps could ever fade into obscurity. They have one holiday. You know how Mariah Carey will be forever be mm -hmm. one thing because of Christmas. Yeah. Peeps will forever be because of Easter. So it doesn't yeah. matter. I don't think Peeps could get out. Also, to sponsor like. To work together with Dr. Pepper and Mike and Ike's, do you need to text them or something? <laughs> you know? <laughs> hey, Doc. Yeah. I'm hey, Doc. To, um, I'm coming in for an appointment. I don't know. And you'd have to maybe, do you have to, do Mike and Ike both have to approve? That's a good question. That's a really good question. You think Mike ever thought about getting rid of Ike? I think they had like, a whole entire movie slash ad campaign about it. Mike versus Ike? Yeah, for like for a while. It was, you know, like the left Twix, right Twix thing? Dude, speaking, the left Twix versus right Twix thing, it got everybody. Yeah, it did. It got everybody. What do you mean got? It's, it doesn't exist. It's the same thing. Like, they, they made it. Are you guys it, confused about well, that? Well, no, 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 no. No, it didn't. I don't. Well, I'm saying they made it seem like, and they packaged it as, like, for a while, oh, buy the left one, team right, team left. Yeah. But it's just Twix. But everybody knew that. I think everyone knew it was kind of a joke. I'm just saying, it went, oh, maybe I'm the only one I got got. Maybe I got got. I didn't, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, fucking, everyone could see. He, <laughs> it's left tricks and right tricks. What do you mean? We're, we're going to believe that he can see through an ad campaign like I that? I definitely did. I think it's smart. Just like how Mike and Ike's. I mean, it's still Mike and Ike's, but on the box, like some of them had Mike, and then Ike was like crossed out. That's They're what I'm saying. Mics. See, it's he like got team. he got 51. percent He got majority stakeholder <laughs> and kicked him out. Immediately kicked him out. But I didn't what believe that they for? were different. I think it just is Ike. Like I know Mike's short for Michael. It's Ike Eichel? That's a good question. I think it's just Ike. It's got to be short for something. I don't think so. Dude, I'm telling you, dude, these weird... It's going to it's gonna be short for something like Ian. And it's gonna be, how did someone come up with Ike from yeah. that? What it's, is Ike short for? For Dwight? 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 Are you fucking pulling my nuts right now? Ike is a masculine name of Hebrew origin, origin of meaning laughter. laughter. Isaac? I kind of get that. Isaac, I get. Isaiah, Isaac, let's say. Yeah. Uh, that, Isaiah. Okay. Is Ike short... For Dwight, can you can you put that right down? There. Is Ike short for Dwight? The, the Isaac thing I can buy. Eisenhower it, Library image long after. So Dwight Eisenhower went by Ike. The fuck? But it, no no guy? no, it was an abbreviation of his last name, Eisenhower. They they made it Ike. Ike. That's not Dwight too. It's Eisen not Dwight. I, so for some reason they make it a note that he referred to himself as a simple country boy. <laughs> <laughs> What is what did he do? Why is he popular? <laughs> He's the president. He talked about himself in that way in the third person. The president? He was the president, yes, Dwight Eisenhower. We called a president Ike. Well, that's how the teddy bear started, right? Theodore Roosevelt. He sent people used to call him Teddy, and then somebody like gave him a bear, and he was like, Oh, the teddy bear. Is that how the teddy bear started? Oh. Well, I mean, stuffed animals existed before then, but teddy bear is a word. There is no this is there is no way this is true. This is a no, Danny Fagg. No, but but the teddy was short for Theodore. He didn't invent that. Right, but, but he invented the teddy bear. Well, not that he invented, but he did. Look this kind up. Of is Look what this up. This is this is checking out. I said he invented like the, the teddy bear, is in like what we call the teddy bear, the teddy bear. Because why why would we even combine the nickname for Theodore and bear? Well, maybe it just wasn't the nickname for maybe you know it was reversed. Like Teddy was first. It's got a fact check on did, here. Did, did, Teddy's short for Theodore. What is the story what behind alluding behind to Theodore Roosevelt, an enthusiastic bear hunter? That 
if Danny said that part, <laughs> that would have helped. Well, greatly. I mean, it's very well known that he's very outdoorsy. Type. I didn't know he was an avid bear hunter. He refused to shoot a bear. Wait, so, so he was, so he was, he was a, a terrible so bear. So he was hunter. a bad ba bear hunter. <laughs> As the story goes, when Collier cornered and stunned a Louisiana black bear for the president's benefit, Roosevelt refused to shoot it. After the incident was publicized, a cartoon was created, and a stuffed toy was made called the Teddy Bear. Teddy, Teddy's, Teddy's, bear. Teddy's Bear. Teddy's Bear, brother. And I guess maybe he was a hunter, but this guy cornered and stunned it just so that the president could shoot it easy. And he was like, no, I shoot my own bears. I hunt my own bears. And he just shoots the guy? Yeah. It's like, actually, the bear cornered you. Oh, it kind of looks like him. I don't know about all that. I mean, that a little like, bit. But do you understand how... That's how he sits and looks up. Like you that. understand that that is a scary image, right? No, it's Do not. you not get scared by that? Do I no. have something? No. I think you do. No, I, I think that That bear, is a scary image. That bear's a little scary looking. I think I have something. But I think you have something, because I don't get freaked out by rabbit toys Jason, either. Jason, can you just look up... See, like, that bear is scary. The one on top. The one on top in the middle. I know, I know. But the one on top in the middle... That picture is scary. No, I find dolls more scary. That's fine. Can you just look up stuff? <clears throat> animals. Oh, look, that's the hold on. That's the cartoon. Teddy's bear. <clears throat> he walked away. From oh, it. it was a baby bear. What are we doing, guy? So that is a correct nothing, Danny fact. By nothing the way. fun about that at all. Just look up. <clears throat> that is a correct Danny fact. Just look up stuffed animals. I just want to see. <laughs> you crushed it on the facts today. You, okay. you, you, you sucked there, on the beach. Really though. terrifying. <laughs> no, no. Scroll. I'll, I'll tell you which one triggers it. Well, first of all, that stuff. Oh, I love that this. Fat bear? I love this fat bear. Oh. This oh, 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 Jason. Oh, that needs to stop. That's a pug. So like that that big bear is scary. That big bear. Is no, this one? that one's not. Scary. Yeah, no, no, no. Scroll Cute. up. Scroll up. Couldn't hurt a fly. Scroll up. That one, that one. Uh, the one on that the right. That one's scary. That one's a to the right. Bit, no, all the way to the no. right. Not your fat, demon bear. That on the right. Yeah. That one's scary. It's That's a, a scary tad bear. more scary, but it's still cute. You don't have to open it. You can, you can leave it. You can leave it. He definitely has a little bit of a mean, frowny face to Dude, him. Dude, look. What's wrong with his mouth? No, I don't know. Can you look up stuffed rabbits? Now, let's just, just trigger me. <laughs> Why are you doing this to yourself? <laughs> I'm afraid of stuffed rabbits because I, I want you guys to understand or see it. Oh God. None of this bothers Jeez, me whatsoever. They're so cute. Jesus Christ. No, you see that one. I don't know why. The one in the dead middle. The brown one in the dead in the middle. This? That Yeah, that one is scary. That one's Do you adorable. get it? I must have something. I must have something. Aww. Jesus, don't. That's, that's enough. <laughs> they, you got something in a past oh, life. Maybe. Like a reincarnation. Maybe. Maybe, right. yeah. stuffed, maybe you were thrown to the pit uh, of rabbits. Stuffed demon. You see, but this one, like an, a, a stuffed animal trying to be scary doesn't do it for me. Yeah. Yeah. Like that's like. No, I, I agree with I, that. You know what I mean? Now, dolls, on the other hand, oh, Jesus. very scary. Basically, every porcelain doll, terrifying. Oh, well, that one's a Chucky. That's a Chucky doll, I think. Yeah, that's from Dude, Chucky. it's weird how lots of people collect dolls, like, unironically. They don't, it's just, they love it. Dude, my, Type in old dolls. Yeah, that's, that's or porcelain get, dolls, or porcelain I think he's trying dolls, to get. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. These, yeah. these, these trigger me, honestly. Get out of yeah. here. Get out of here. Wow, something really weird deep inside me, just something clicked. It was very weird. I yeah, don't like I don't it like at this all. at all. One of our friends, his grandma collects yeah. old dolls. And so, like, one time I walked into her room, <laughs> and it's just, like, fucking 100 of them all lining the, yeah. the walls. It's terrifying. My, uh... Oh, see, I don't like with the eyes and the, the hard face. I don't like that at all. Danny hates a hard face. Yeah, my, my grandmother used to collect uh, porcelain clowns. Oh! And my mom, like, she put it all in my mom's room because she just that's, she thought it was, like, a fun kid thing like to collect my mom terrified of clowns now terrified dude, of clowns. Well, people, did people have fucking nothing to do before the internet yes. like, well, how is this yes. the people their hobbies they're just collecting creepy shit i mean dude, some of them are battery powered and they like blink and their eyes look around too and also like collecting things was way more impressive before the internet yeah like sure. the fact that that now you just go on eBay and the, get everything. Yeah, exactly. I can get your whole collection. Bro, the whole collection in one batch. That's not cool. But you know, like my grandmother with all the dolls of, and the clowns, it's almost, you need to really go out and get these things. Like yeah. to have t more than 30 porcelain clowns, there's not just a porcelain clown store. You know what I mean? Yeah. Now there's, you can go to porcelainclown.com. Yeah, get, yeah get honestly, there's them. probably, Etsy probably has a whole porcelain clown section. I, I had a porcelain clown that I... Never thought it was creepy, but one of our friends came over to my house 
and saw it and was like, oh my god, it's terrifying. <laughs> and then and then like a few weeks later, I brought the porcelain clown in my bag <laughs> to his house. <laughs> and he called me and he was like, what the fuck is this doing here? <laughs> You're just like, oh, I was looking for that. Where'd it go? <laughs> and I was like, what? What are you talking about? And he went, no, fuck off, Danny. <laughs> That's, That's evil. Funny. That's an evil that thing. Is very evil. That's, evil evil. Thing. That's such a Danny thing but to do. It was do. very funny. That same thing. One of our other friends is terrified of the ring. <laughs> and didn't someone someone like played it on his TV? Bro, we played it on his TV, and he almost like the girl coming out of the well. Yeah, by he, the way, he, he almost <laughs> like first of all, he was screaming like genuinely like fear. I, I like immediately. It's one of those pranks where you feel bad. Yeah, you know that's how real it was. And he was gonna break the TV <laughs> like before looking for the remote. Just the fastest option to get it off. Yeah. He, was, he was going for the TV. He was like, forget it, forget it, forget it. You know. Scares, man. Yeah, I know. All right, look up Porcelain Clown. I want to see if we can find it. This one had a, a bunch of balloons, too. Porcelain Clown with balloons. Oh, no. These are, I've never seen these. These are fucking terrifying. These, are, these, just, <laughs> these bother me. Most if, of these just look like dolls. If I went to a girl's house and she had this, I'm leaving. <laughs> I don't care. What are, write in the comments what you collect, or if, if your parents or grandparents collected something weird. Do you, know, do you know that every clown has, like, a trademarked face? What the fuck is that? So, mean? like, if you're a clown... You can trademark your own makeup, okay, uh, for all other clowns, like so they don't use it. And so the way they trademark it is you put it on an egg. If you click that one, Jason, with uh, right above, yeah, that. So like his look with the red around there and the the eyes with the uh, you know the black things on top bottom. That's what you're talking about. And it would be yeah, on yeah, an yeah. egg. <clears throat> type type like clown face eggs. So there's a whole museum of like clown eggs, and they all have their faces on them. The egg registry. I yeah. hate this. Oh, no. <laughs> I hate this. This is a museum? Yeah. So is it on there? Like Pennywise, probably? I think it has to be real, like, life-practicing clowns. Like, these are, like, you know... These... We had to go to clown All right, college. Can, can you go back to that image you just did, the, the one below? That old man with that mustache, <laughs> that's not a clown. That is just an old man. Well, maybe it's a woman. <laughs> Wait, that's... which one? The bottom, 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 that one. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, that, that I is... thought you meant top left. I thought you meant top left, too. No, no, that's just Chaplin. I don't know, like what that is a little Chaplin-y. So yeah, okay. So you're saying that the, your combination of colors and makeups and spots and shapes on your face—that's all. That's your look. Yeah, and you can't and, go. You can't double up. And once you put it in the egg registry, if someone else tries to copy your look, you can say, "Hey, bitch, I got an egg." And now, what if I want to change my look? Am I locked in because the egg, or do I have to go boil a new egg? That's a great question. You probably have to go get a, a, a batch of eggs, or you just have a chicken. Just keep popping out new faces. Now, what if someone collected the, <laughs> collected these and you walked in their house, saw a cabinet case full of, <laughs> full of these eggs? I'm out. This is shockingly yeah. Easter themed. Oh, or, or it's locked. This <laughs> yeah. is shockingly Easter themed. We're full circle. <laughs> or, you know, like, it's a, the dad collecting these eggs and he comes out like, hiya. You know, it's like yeah. a full clown. Got Jason just, like, physically cringed <laughs> at, at the thought. See, look, look, that's, that's, a, that's a guy with his own egg. Yeah, and that and he did a good job with that. <laughs> oh, he, he did, did do a good job. Nose. Yeah, he's much less scary than the egg. <laughs> is that weird? I mean, some clowns are sc scarier than others for sure. So why is it that clown college is harder to get into than Harvard? Is that true? That's they what have he used a to say. they have a lower acceptance rate. So they are they are denying people at a rate <laughs> that is higher than Harvard, which is interesting. Yeah. Maybe it's just because only one person is only one person is like. I guess that would still be a hundred percent acceptance rate if only one person applied and then they got accepted. That would be a hundred percent acceptance rate. The person has a better chance of getting into Harvard than the Ringling Brothers and Bar Barnum Bailey. Why is it so long? Barnum Ringling and Brothers clown. and Barnum and Bailey Clown College. But the Ringling Brothers—they're saying it being part of the circus. I mean, that's not surprising. An extensive admission process and the seriousness of learning to be a clown. We know someone went to clown school, didn't? Don't we? Uh, his name is Antonio. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. No, that's why the acceptance rate's so low. He applies every year and gets denied. <laughs> I don't know how. I don't know how I walked into. Him. I don't know how no, I walked Jason, into dunk on him. One. Dunk on him. Dunk I don't on know him. Jason, that one. he doesn't even have his own egg, bitch. You want this? <laughs> no, he's bribing Jason you with this? the churro kick you ass. How'd you get so many? I don't have a lot. I don't have any. I'll How'd take... you get so many? Oh, he's stacking them up. Where, back where there. did you find them? Did you come over the, here and grab him when you were I only gave him one, so he's, he was coming over here and sneaking him. Yeah, but they, they only accept 50 people a year out of thousands. Wow. So 
how many people apply? Thousands. Thousands a year. Which is like way less than Harvard, but still, if they only accept 50, then, you know, that's that's a lower acceptance rate. I wonder, I guess it's like acting school. That's Those are hard to get into, I think. Yeah. And also, that's Barnum and Bailey. That's the guy that walked the, the elephants across the bridge. Yeah. What the hell is that? Uh, to test out the, the strength of the Brooklyn Bridge, because everybody was afraid that it would fall, Barnum and Bailey like b- marched a bunch of elephants across it. Huh. But then Barnum and Bailey shut down because there was like a bunch of elephant people that said, "Oh, we don't like the elephants being part of the circus. They're mistreated." Blah blah blah. And they definitely are. <laughs> they like yeah. They beat the <laughs> fuck out of them until they can balance on a ball. Is that yeah. true? Were elephants able to balance on a oh, ball? Oh yeah, it was awesome. I used to go to the circus every year. I went to the full blown circus one time. <laughs> full blown. As circus. in, you know, hey, you half blown circus. <laughs> no, no, yeah, but the rest of the time was half blown. I was half blown by circuses. Like the hay on the ground and all the clowns running around and coming up the stands and dunking each other. I don't believe that. Well, that's not. I don't believe this. How do they get up on it? How do you teach an elephant to balance on a ball? They, they beat them into it. You what does that mean? Or you give them treats. I'm talking about just the, first of all, who comes up with the idea? Like, how about we have this elephant balance on a ball? And then successfully teaching them how to do that. Don't you understand? Like, this that I, I, I like hard? how, like, can you click that, what you just had? It said, this is a cruel and unnecessary act, but it does show how agile they are. <laughs> That's it's what like, I'm saying. It's like, this is cruel, but it is cool. It's kind of fucking awesome. <laughs> like, it's not cool to do it anymore, but it was awesome, dude. You had to see this shit. It, it, it was awesome. All right. Well, happy Easter, everybody. Uh, JT, where can they find you? You can find me hop, hop, hopping away. I don't know what that meant. <laughs> find me on Instagram at the J Balls. You can find me at Danny is watching. You can find me at Aunt Prisco. Can't forget to follow the Picky Boys on Instagram and Twitch, and also follow the gaming channel. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. 